the series. After the wow, this game too. <laughs> Now these are the jerseys I grew up with. Uh, the blue, dark blue. God. Oh yeah, I grew I grew up with the with the Indians too. It's just <laughs> they changed their name. Okay, and the lineup looks good. Okay. Final game. Carlos, that is not Carlos Carrasco. And that is not Adam Wainwright. <laughs> I got cookie. I got cookie. By the way, this whole time for my thumbnail, I haven't been, I haven't been showing the little pop-up thing. On the th uh, so I can get it for a thumbnail. There we go. Carlos Carrasco back in a guard's uniform. If he plays like his uh, Diamond Dynasty card a little bit, that'd be pretty good. Oh, his meter's just like the Diamond Dynasty. Oh, I like it. Ooh, I love it. Oh, it was such a good trade for Carlos Carrasco. This is Dylan Carlson. Pitch misses inside. And that's inside. Swings through that one for strike one. It gives me a heart attack every time I throw a curveball. Also, I don't know if it's going to go in the zone or not. <laughs> That was a fitty fitty call. That was like right on the line. I do have ump on like perfect, so I mean, I didn't know if I wanted to have have it on average, so. <laughs> Series playing at Oregon State. He played along with Adley Rutschman and Nick Madrigal, and he took home a gold glove his first year in the majors 2022. We're talking about a guy who makes great contact. Hard to throw it past him. Andres Jimenez. The bat. Swing and a foul straight back. Wainwright winds and fires. In the air, right field. Donovan. That's Go not back. gone. That's a warning track. <laughs> Two down. Jose. Yeah, but he has 48 power, though. I mean. Light drive. And that's just foul. Chris Adam Wainwright for all the yeah, I mean it's Andres Jimenez. He doesn't hit very many. Well, actually, he he hits about an average home run. I mean, I got underneath it a little bit. 
I wasn't up up enough for it. So, I mean, Jose can hit that. I mean, Jose can hit that fastball clean out of here. I mean, yeah, but yeah. Well, I was all over it with Jimenez. It's just his power sucks. <laughs> I needed that to be perfect, perfect, basically. This guy is at the top of the list. The pitch. Swing and a miss. That's strike one. Stud. When you look at players like this, you play that hot corner. Got to be pretty courageous over there with the way balls come off the bat. Oh, That's the kind of guy that every year you expect him to be in the all-star game and have a gold glove, if not a platinum glove. Out to short. On the run. The Lindor. Two up, two down. That's what a good sinker is designed to do. Get a guy to roll over a little bit, hit the ball on the ground, kill some worms while you're at it. All the young. The batter now as he swings and misses for strike one. Swing and a miss. Looked off balance that time. Popped up. Oh, that's going to be a blooper. God, that was a nice blooper. And stepping in for the Cardinals, Brendan Donovan. And it's fouled away. Second inning here, no score. Fell off to a great start. He's really cruising out there on the mound. He's got a chance to get through these first two innings with under And back to back blo pitches. bloopers right there. Deep into this game. Oh, okay. Well, it, it was borderline a blooper. It wasn't a live drive. It wasn't a line drive by any short. That, you know. It got over. It got over Jose enough to just get in there, and that's going to be a run. Here we go. This is just like last game. <laughs> oh, perfect, perfect. Okay. Okay, apparently the center of the the center of the field is just the hot zone. And you're somehow just hitting them all in there on a late. I didn't even die for it. That was his fucking call. Dylan Carlson in the dirt. Wow, that's a great job behind the dish there. And a base hit. How do you not? One runs in. And then he takes 20 years to throw it. We're just, okay, we're just going to continue like the last game. We're just going to shit the bed early. Like, seriously? And that was 20 years out of the zone. God. We're just starting the game out like last game, huh? Ripped on a line to center. Oh, thank God. And they get Goldschmidt for the out. And that will end the inning. This is how we want to start. I don't know how Menez does not grab that. Like, that is that should be 100% grabbed. Yeah, Jimenez doesn't grab shit. Singy, here's an Adam Wainwright <laughs> nugget. He's faced every team in the majors except the St. Louis Cardinals. Oh, yeah. Fucking first baseman over there. I don't know who's your first baseman. Goldschmidt. Okay. Jimenez can't do shit at second. At all. I'm not even surprised at this point. It's like it's like the like MLB just wants to start me at 4-0. I mean, we might as well just start the game 4-0. I mean... It's gonna get to the wall. Oh, he's in. I mean, we I hit it so hard it hit the wall. Oscar 
swing, and that ball smashed on a line. In one hops off the wall, should be extra bases. He's in safely at second as a run scores. Picks himself up in RBI. Ripped that one down the line and kept it fair. And even when you hit it that far out front, you still have to keep your hands tight to your body so you don't hook around that baseball and put it in foul territory. And that right there was perfect. Bo Naylor at the plate now. In the dirt, blocked. Nothing happening on the bases, though. Second and third, two down. And he's down oh, oh, he that is the slowest ass curveball I think I've ever seen. Wainwright comes set, fires. Foul ball still 0-2. Change of speeds, he goes off the off speed to the fastball, and the hitter doesn't know what's coming next. He swings and hits a fly. Then we leave runners stranded, but we got to run. <laughs> Damn it. Fucking Bo, why you have to be a 65? <laughs> Okay, Carlos Carrasco, are we just going to, you know, our defense, uh, are we just going to just fuck up all the time? Yeah, we're just going to fuck up all the time. <laughs> I don't get why the hell it's that, f it's at, I throw this shit in the dirt and it still goes almost to the top of the zone. Way back there. It's probably off the wall. And it hits the fence. And the oh, if I was on target with that, that. <laughs> well, it's going to be a 6 1 ball game. I mean, I don't know what the fuck Carrasco's doing. Well, oh, that's 6 1 ball game. I want to go jump off a bridge right now. I mean, I don't get what the hell's going on at this point. I gotta bring in a reliever that has not even warmed up. <laughs> Just doesn't have the same intensity to it, but he's got to find a way because these batters count the same for his stats, obviously, regardless of the score. Next offering is in for a strike. Hit weakly on the ground. They get one. Over to first, safe. Almost got the double play. If he didn't flip it like that, like... Well, but hold on, actually, if it wasn't a slow roller, probably would have been a double play. Okay. Fucking A. Carlos Carrasco. I would say warning shot, but that like Stephen Kwan that would be at the wall. First homer for Cleveland. Give me a hit. Switch hitter. That's all you're getting. And that's out number one. Danny Murray, no doubt. Bam. He makes the grab. One away. Here's Andres Jimenez. We talk about guys with good speed, and definitely he has it. But pushing the offense aside for just a second, Chris, it's the defensive side that I think the speed factors in the most. Well, he gets to balls that get by most people at that position. 
it's just really impressive because there are certain times the ball comes off the bat, automatically that team that hit it thinks that they've got the bases, and he just takes it away. Over to Goldie. And a couple of quick outs. Well, he's doing a nice job of keeping the ball out of the air, lets the defense work behind him with another ground ball. Good execution. On the ground, right side. I want to go jump off a bridge and hope I, I want to go jump off a bridge and hope a speedboat hits me at the fastest mile an hour I can go. My team always had like the the first game didn't even start out like this. The 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 last two I don't get what the fuck my team is doing. Both of my last two pitchers throw shit not even where I fucking put it. Not even close to where I put it. Uh, I don't think the third game it's gonna happen. Uh, I don't know. I better say a prayer. in the air shallow left field makes the catch for the out two outs base is empty and now Dylan Carlson so I only hope at this point and first offering is fouled off I didn't say pray I said down thinking Josh Naylor I <laughs> I'm praying, hell yeah. To catch up to, especially with that velocity. Out towards right center field, Brennan, as he glides to his left, okay. flashes the leather on the running. Edge. Okay. Uh, are we gonna get the mirror? Are we gonna get a miracle this game? Please, give me a sign or something. Josh Naylor got a home run. He hasn't done shit since. Comes up empty as he, chases that he ain't gonna do shit. <laughs> Holy shit, he did shit. That's that's an out. I was hoping it might have fucking blooped or to the left, but nope. Okay, Goldschmidt, I didn't know can dive like that. <laughs> I did. They apparently scored that as an error. The fuck? They scored that as an error? Here's a high chopper. Wow. It scored it like an E3 error. Take advantage of this situation. This feels like their chance. Right hander kicks deals. And foul. Oh my god. On the ground a second. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Let's just hit it. Good timing into the double fucking play. Okay, well, I ain't fucking doing Back now at Progressive Field. New inning getting started. And stepping in for the Cardinals. Well, this is the game where I guess I'm not going to do shit for the rest of it. God just gave me the sign. Every outing matters for relievers and their numbers, but I think it's tough to And I mean, all he needed to do was stay up and run to it. I mean, just reach a hand out, bro. I mean, it's not that hard.
play. Now it's the second baseman, Nolan Gorman. He swings and fouls one off. Strike two. They really need to hang in there with that front side against this left-handed breaking ball. Next one is off the plate. And a count, one and two. And a pitch. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And welcome back. Bottom of the inning. Now it's the right fielder, Oscar Gonzalez. The wide to kick the pitch. Now a screamer into the outfield. Newt Bar takes it in. Like, come the fuck on, bro. <laughs> I'm all over it. Barrel and everything. The hell? These hitters are going to have to find a way to be a little more patient, see more pitches per at bat. Otherwise, Fulpen's not going to have to work. All right, to the second base. Oh, wow. Holy shit, it was about time one of your guys decided to fuck up routine balls. Out time, pick the hell of a time to fucking do it. That's the key. You still have to extend through the baseball in order to hit a line drive like that. At the play, Stephen Kwan swinging a foul straight back. Holy shit, that was the first pitch I think I've seen all day. That wasn't a fastball or a fucking curveball. That's not landing. That's a hit. The throw in, and that's the second out of And Bo Naylor just had to stop in between second and first for fucking, I guess. Well, yeah, but it just costed us the fucking a run on second and first. So I mean, if anything couldn't go fucking more wrong, it has now. And then right to your second baseman, and yeah, good timing on it, and every. Like, bro, like, do how many times am I going to get bent over and fucked and have to crawl my way out of it somehow? Like, I ain't going to crawl out of this one. There ain't no shot. And there's a strike. And like, if, if it was 4-1 and fucking Carlos Carrasco didn't decide to shit the bed on perfect time fucking pitches, I mean, would have been fucking great. But no, he shat the bed, and now I'm down fucking 6-1. Seeing the ball out of the pitcher's hand, you cannot hang a breaking ball right there. Lucky it stayed in the ballpark. Swing and a foul straight back. And now the lefty. Base knock center field. Everything was on time and fluid in that swing. Got a pitch you could get the barrel on and lined it into center for the knock. Those always feel good. Contreras. Now in the box. Comes up empty with a swing there. It is to throw that breaking ball with just a little more conviction to get the swing and miss. Gets a piece and it stays 0-2. Kicks and deals. Foul ball, it stays nothing in two. And there's a fly ball, deep right field. That's back. It's top of the zone. Good timing. It goes right where you can hit it. This game just wanted... The game gave me, uh, uh, had me have a comeback, and then this game just, you know, fucking, it wants to fuck the shit out of me, so. Eli Morgan taking over on the mound. Well, they need someone to stop the bleeding and keep the score right where it is. Seems like a tough task today with the way this lineup is swinging it. Morgan fills up the zone, forces contact, so not a huge strikeout. Swing, and this one's blasted. It's got a chance. To the warning track, makes the catch. 
but although you like the fact that the guy throws strikes guy gets contact and not always great contact the fact that when you have runners on if that ball's in play there's still a good chance liner and that should be extra bases takes the turn he's digging for second in safely it's a double and his second hit didn't take long to get a result for that at bat anytime you can drive a ball into the gap the other way it feels so good and that's when you know you're right where you need to be at the plate and it's even better when it gets you extra bases love looking in at your dugout and seeing the guys fired up man on second two down in the dirt gets to it on to first and it's in time for the third out so that'll end the inning Cleveland, bottom of the sixth inning. Now it's Jose Ramirez. Number 55, Ryan Helm. Here comes a pitch. Swing and a miss as he was late that time. Bases. Now he turns and heads for second. And he greets the new arm from the bullpen with a double. Couldn't have timed it up any better than that. Pulled that one right in the direction of the shifted defense, but no one can make the play on it. I mean, that's his approach, and it's probably not changing. Arenado makes the grab one away. Oh, that's what he's looking for with the fastball above the zone. A swing and miss or weak contact. Francisco Lindor comes up to the plate. There's a strike. Well, triple digits on the gun. I know there are more guys that can reach that now than in the past, but it's still impressive to watch. One. And a foul ball. Very high with that one. It's a ball and two strikes. That's a really good job of laying off the 0-2 high fastball. Is going to make that pitcher really have to respect this hitter, even though he's behind the count. away at second swing and a miss struck him out pulled the string of the changeup will brennan digs in for the guardians on the ground to short throw to first ball game gg on the third one i felt so fucked in that one Carlos Carrasco, I mean, Carlos Carrasco, I guess, just has no control, I guess, because fucking, it didn't matter if it was good timing, perfect, or whatever, it did not go where I placed it, so, it never went where I placed it, so, oh well.